This is how we will continue to protect ourselves. This is how we will protect our family and in particular the elderly members of our By family. By continuing to stay vigilant, to follow our foundations and work together, we can continue to keep our communities, our families. And we give everyone our word that we will devote everything we've got to defeating this. That COVID-19 can be characterized as a pandemic. COVID-19 affects all parts of our lives, from health and safety to work and leisure practices. Just as individuals, organizations, and businesses struggle to figure out how to plan and react to the pandemic, so too do governments. The purpose of this course is to examine how Indigenous, municipal, provincial, and national governments have approached the challenges presented by COVID-19 and to analyze the public policy decisions made by these different governments. This course is jointly taught by JSGS faculty and executives and residents, thus providing students with insights from both theory and practice. Every week will feature a different instructor examining policy topics related to COVID-19. Among the topics covered are the nature of risk and uncertainty created by COVID-19, the nature of the modeling done to support policy decisions, the manner in which First Nations are addressing the pandemic, the direct and indirect impacts of COVID-19 on Canada's health, the fiscal impacts of the policy responses, and the implications of COVID and how things like health research and elderly care should be done in the future. Public policy will continue to play a prominent role in COVID-19. Of Ontarians from across the province have been saying our government has launched new programs and made new investments to help businesses reopen safely. Be at the Get forefront and join the discussion in this course on COVID-19 policy. Yeah.